So Carencia, all eyes on him. We know what a talented type he is. And the last one loads in. So Carenzi is going off the favourite. Box three, first up for about three months. Set to run. Let's see what he can do here. They're ready. Racing. Carencia a jump brilliantly here. He's going to scorch down and lead. Dynamic Lee's a length away second. Now Slippery Jack found the rail third, then Resolute Lee. A gap to Lily's lad. Then came Cutie Lee and Missing Queen. Carencia by two. Dynamic Lee tries to stick with Carencia, but he turns clear Carencia. Two and a half on Dynamic Lee, and that's a good return to the racetrack. Carencia from Dynamic Lee. Resolute Lee got third and fourth Lily's lad, I think. From Slippery Jack, Cutie Lee and Missing Queen last in. The time on resumption here is around 22. 21.96. So that's a great return to uh, Carencia. Jump well, found the rail and out in front. He was going to be mighty hard to beat. And he's defeated Dynamic Lee, who's tried to stick with him. And number eight, Resolute Lee, third. That's a great return to the track for him. Number two, fourth, Lily's Lad. 6.92, the early split, 12.20. On the way home, Carency at about $2.50 on the U-Tab. And I guess the punters were just gambling on the fact that was he forward enough to win first up? You bet he was. 21.96 is a great return. 3.482 after race seven here at Angle Park. The winners prepared by Kieran Corby. They ran a 6.92 early split and a 12.20 on the way home.